how will the young guns handle the psychological letdown? And then there's the withdrawal symptoms, as inspirational captain Tony Popovic prepares to say goodbye and head for Japan. Plenty of challenges for the league leaders, as the rejuvenated Adelaide City travels to Adenzo Park. That's our Ericsson Cup match of the day, Sydney United versus Adelaide City. Our commentator, Paul Williams. And both sides just seem to be a little bit sluggish to start the game, which may mean some mistakes in defence. We've seen a couple of hints of that about to happen tonight. Tobin into the tackle. Ivanovic just mopping up. Well, Svetko did well to anticipate there. And now Sydney United a pinch possession. Milicic touches to the right. Marusic may try his luck. He does as well. And well worth a try as well. It was swerving and dipping. And Pekovic had to watch. Marusic cutting inside. Which in there, Drillich offside. Fine move though. Well, it must have been close. And Branko Kalina in passive as ever. But look at the quality of the cross. Talk about accuracy putting it onto Drillich's head. Drillich moved into the gap, flicked on, beat the goalkeeper. Drillich just strayed past the last defender before Marusic played the ball in. Rudan, Babic working his way forward, need to get there quickly, did very well. Still Babic, chance here for United. Trokoski onto the left foot, good ball to the back post. Over the bar from Svetko. But off an Adelaide City defender, Babic did very well. Costanzo. Milicic blocked. Tchaikovsky pulled it back. Chance here. Surely the opening goal. Pekovic wasn't even called into action in the end there. As Sydney United switch a plate. Moritz nods it on. Just a little bit too close to Pekovic. Not a lot that Moritz could do there. Babic got in front of a flat-footed Visitano and Trojkovsky who you could never accuse of being flat-footed gets in another cross Drillich at the back post Bilokopic Trojkovsky might try his luck, good shot! Well I think he's just a little bit tired of knocking in all these crosses so he decided to go into alone there Robert Trojkovsky with another well-worked move from Sydney United. Bilokopic played that lovely ball there. And he took the shot on the run. And Petkovic had to take two grabs at the ball before he got it under control. It was a patient build-up from Sydney United. And the shot was lashed in by Rob Trykowski. As Milicic continues to apply the pressure. Good pull back here. Chance, surely. So many of the good things that come from Sydney United come from him and Svetko. Lost out there under the tackle from Ivanovic. Hassel picks up a loose ball. Manilo. This is dangerous. Hassel goes on. Brad Hassel through the centre. Babic coming across to get him. Still Hassel. He's clipped it past and that is an opening goal of real style. And that is what Adelaide City are all about. This counter-punching style has worked for them again. Manillo with that little touch to keep the ball moving. Hassel was onto it like a shot. He outpaced Mark Babic who came across to try and just distract him. And a well-guided shot, wrong-footed Kalats. And a quality finish 
for Hassel's third goal of the season and Adelaide City have taken the lead. He was always calm despite the pressure from Babich. He didn't try and burst the net he left to Japan in the new year. So he may as well start now. Babich, can he do something? They're running into each other's path there. Lovely skill for a big man. Mark Babich. Milicic. Drilic. Markovats. Across here, Drilic, surely. Oh, what a save from Pekovic. Great cross. Milicic just got a firm foot on ball. Maybe that will inspire Sydney United to something. Markovats, the goalkeeper stayed on his line. Markovats, good shot. Drilled into the body of Petkovic by Robbie Markovats. Well, his coach has asked him to make an impact as a substitute, and he's done that without a doubt. Sweetly hit on the volley. Get some early involvement here. Been playing in Malaysia in the Malaysian second division. And was somewhat of a surprise selection in the Socceroo lineup for the Four Nations tournament. And here he is, early involvement here against. What a response this would be. It's saved by some John Gibson defending. And let's have another look at this incident. Gents with a brilliant run into the penalty area. He didn't go for goal, he squared it. And his teammates were a little slow to react. Adelaide City can steal the points here. Game off, it's Brad Hassel, normally so cool in front of goal. And that did not miss by much. And Milicic down the other end now. Ante Milicic fires it across. Surely an own goal, I'd say. But either way, United have equalised. Finally, something for Branko Kalina's side to celebrate. A response with around... 15 and a half minutes to go and Milicic just ripped it across and it was put into the back of his own goal by Brad Armour. Well, if he'd let that go it would have gone away for a goal kick but I'm sure he doesn't need me to tell him that. But Marusic and Milicic involved. Milicic got past the final defender who drilled it across here and Armour couldn't help himself. And the man of the match was Sydney United's dashing flanker, Robert Tchaikovsky, who now seems to be fully recovered from the leg injury.